Hello again, it's those Gillers and today we have every play. <gasps> Quick and easy smoky cumin pork tacos. So these are interesting. We've never made these before, so let's <laughs> begin. <laughs> okay, so Krista has onions, so you have to trim thinly sliced scallions, separating whites from grains. Can we talk about the size difference between okay. these ones and these ones? What are you going to want to do, Adrian? Do you want cilantro or limes? Cilantro. <laughs> hey, I thought we had four cilantros out. What? I thought so too. Did I accidentally okay. put one back? I guess I ate it. Oh. So for the cilantro, it's going to be... Just pick the leaves off. Okay. Doesn't say to cut, it just says pick the leaves off. Pick the leaves off! Yep, I put it back in. Okay. Oh no. So they give us 40 cilantros. Chris is going to do the green onions or scallions. Otherwise, I'm going to scallions. So I guess I'm going to do the lime, which needs to be quartered. That's it. Okay. And then uh, reserve some of the spice from the, to the side for some reason before I start cooking. Oh, it's scallion whites have to be done before I start cooking anyways. Okay. So I thought, so I thought, I'm a fast faster man. I'm not fast enough. <laughs> You're not fast enough. <laughs> Ew? What happened? Ew. They gave me part of one. <laughs> oh, just throw that away or it, it looks raw. That one looks rotted, so just throw that part away. I wonder if it will fit here so they get the taller hole. Oh. Look, they gave me a little tiny extra. Oh, and it's sort of rotty on the top. It's falling apart. Okay, so I've got to quarter the lines up. This recipe has a lot of things, but it's supposed to be an easier one because it's not that much chopped. The, the thing is already the slaw. Most of the time, the slaw is already chopped for us. The pigs think they get something. Oh, wait, they can have the stems, right? Yeah, yeah they, they, can, they can eat the stems of the cilantro, yeah. Oh, okay. Right. Then I'll start warm. I'll put the tortillas in the oven, but I'll put it on a lot lower this time because they baked too much that last time. The tortillas! The tortillas got too warm. Too crusty. Dusty and crusty! Yep. So, what's the amount of reserve? One four teaspoon cumin, which would be three fourths. And one four teaspoon of smoked paprika. Oh no, not again. Oh no, they broke. Throw them away. No, I just need to pop back <laughs> in. And then you'll cry about them forever if we do them away. Mixing spices together. Yeah. So I need one fourth of this. Three fourths. I need one fourth. Three. One fourth times three. Let me get some scissors. Let me get a spatula. Spatula. My spatula. No. Spatula. Hey, it's a spittoon. At least we weren't filming yesterday when I was being crazy, right? Yeah, geez. Oh wait, or maybe I would have missed a good time. Uh, 
I was telling a wholesome and heartwarming story. Okay, so three fourths of that we got smoked. And then three fourths of the human package. That was almost all the package of that one. package of this one. Okay, set aside. Set outside. Oh, boy. Okay. What is that burning smell? Something's in the oven burning. Whoa. I don't know what it is. I don't see anything, but... I don't see anything in there burning, but it's smoky. Something definitely burned. Yeah. From something from what we, what we cooked yesterday in there. A whole bunch of stuff. Well, we call, oh, it's, it's bacon grease. Okay, that it, there's bacon grease from yesterday. Causing smoke in our oven. Yeah. Oh no, I still have to cut the onions. Oh no, I need the onions for the pork and the pork for the onions. Where's the knives? I ate them all. I'm just kidding, guys. I didn't eat any knives before you guys start freaking out. There were no knives consumed. <laughs> Okay, so you can see what I can do while I'm waiting for that. I guess I can make the... Oop, now I did. Just kidding. Hee <laughs> hee. With the salad. Coleslaw. Coleson. Sharp. 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 Big old bowl of coleslaw. Maybe we just don't eat enough coleslaw. Maybe we're supposed to eat it. But the tacos are too small. You can't fit that much on there. Yeah, you can't fit the coleslaw. Whenever we have coleslaw, I try to put it in a mouth that looks like it fits with the rest of the food, but <laughs> it's still not enough, I guess. You did just give us tons. Okay, so what do I do with that? So, I gotta put the reserve of the cumin and paprika in there. Add sour cream. So we got four sour creams to put in here. Chrissy gets to cook the pork, so she's good. She's doing the onions for it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What happened? Mm -hmm. Two. Here are all the stems. <laughs> okay, you can throw the stems in the guinea pig. They can have all the stems as a treat. Because they are very good guinea pigs. <laughs> yep. It's almost their birthday. They're going to be four years old. They finally opened up their red and box that they had. I don't know what was inside it. I guess they ate it. Oh gosh, yeah, that's probably something they could eat. <laughs> Ooh, this is good. So then I gave them their other rattle basket. See if they can open that one as well.
Okay. Um. So, we'll squeeze the lime juice and a few drops of red stuff. This special red sauce. <laughs> this is not this. This, this is the racha. The hot sauce. Sauce. Ceviche. One day she's gonna stop making that special red sauce. She can't make it forever. <laughs> That's her special red sauce. So wait, it's not gonna be special. If she keeps making it, right? Yeah, I guess not. It's special to me. It's special because she makes it, right? Nobody makes special red sauce like I do. So we have graduated to the golden tongs now. Tong, 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 tong. Golden. They didn't have ruby tongs, so we just got golden. Okay. What? Oh. Add the cilantro to here and mix it up. And then the scaling greens are going to go in here too when she's done with those. And a big, a couple big pieces of salt and pepper. While I get ready to tong tong tong. You should have just done all the whites first so I can get them. Wait, so all the cilantro, all the cilantro. All the cilantro. Yeah, all the cilantro goes in there. I say I have to dump it all in there. <laughs> it's another crazy mix. I always cut the greens first because if I cut the barn first, the greens are going to fall apart and be harder to cut. Oh. I have to cut each tube individually. Okay, that's fine. I'll wait. I mean, I could start I doing still gotta, it that way, but like... I still got to get these wrapped up and put in the oven to keep them, get them warmed up. So I'm going to wrap some tortillas. Tortillas! I wanted a tortilla! Too bad that the little girl has gaps under them so you can't slide tortillas in there around food dodges. <laughs> yeah. Why would you ever need to, though? Okay, so let's up the door a little bit. Oh. They have like things you can put tortillas in, but it's like only thing with a lot of tortillas when you actually need the tortilla warmer. Is that what you're talking about? Or a toaster? No, I was joking about sliding tortilla underneath this slot on someone's door. Oh! Like on the <laughs> gap between the door and the floor. That'd be funny. Just <laughs> when they don't eat dinner, so you give them the Or when Peppa's locked in her room, just slide the tortilla under the door. And then use the blower, blower on the shop back to blow the lettuce and ingredients on it. <laughs> <laughs> Have fun! Okay, so these are going to go in the oven on warm. Dude, good damn work, Burgles. This one smells especially juicy. Juicy like my stories. <laughs> You like my stories. My stories are not juicy. I lied. I lied. Okay, we'll be back in a minute when I start to cook the pork. It's not because of Adrian's singing. Cause she's stirring up the, the, all that stuff right now, and then she's gonna put the and Chris is done with the I mean she's gonna put the green onions in there. Okay, I was wondering. And then big big finger full of salt and big finger full full of pepper. Okay, so Chris is going to put, we got crispy onions that are going to go on the taco, so she's putting them in. I'm going to start the pork and the onions, the pork and beans, yeah. Beans! Pork and beans piece. Can you, is it possible to get beans under the door? It's not possible to get beans under the door. Uh, that would be messy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you could put them a little, uh, if, it depends on how wide the gap is under the door. Like, in our house, we have a D.R. Horton house, so some of the rooms have big gaps underneath the door that are crooked. But, I don't know, in a regular house, you'd, I mean, you could put a few smashed beans in with some foil and then <laughs> put it under the door. Otherwise, it would be like a big, big mess. I think the corner, one of the corners of my room, the walls aren't aligned properly because whenever I try to align a poster, it looks crooked even <laughs> if I put it perfectly straight. Dear so, I, had, I kept trying to put my, I 
I, I, it's just in my Thor post, there's so many times I measured it. Made sure it was straight, but still it crooked when I put it in the corner. So I had to move it back a little from the corner. <laughs> wow, they gave us so many crispy onions this time. Never buy a brand new DR Horton home before, because it needs a lot of repairs before it's good. Look at the cereal, <laughs> add milk. Yeah. yeah, add some milk from Kyung Yin. Mm -hmm. Okay, so over here I got the onions and the pork and I have to cook a little bit. Yeah, chicken broth. Mm -hmm. That would be so salty. Imagine just eating a bowl of chicken broth that was floating Yeah, in it. oh man. I guess it'd be like really salty. Mm -hmm. Don't yell over them. Mm -hmm. I accidentally oh. scissors, I Uh oh. The guinea pigs got their food, but they're still meow meowing. They're still asking for more, even though they had some food. They're always hungry. <laughs> okay. Except for if you overfeed them, and then they just lay and you're like, oh, I wish we could eat more. Yeah. <laughs> okay, somebody can put the rest of the cumin and paprika in this meat. Okay, yeah, Aiden's still messing with the, the coleslaw. See. So all of it, even the open packages. Wait, where did the rest of it go? In the um, coleslaw. Um, I, before, before I gave you, I let the coleslaw go to you. It, I put the cumin and stuff oh in there. I just realized that if yeah. you hold the tongs close, you can also stir with it. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Many modes for the tongue tongue tongue. Clip clips. Clip clips. We have the white guy. There it is. I hit. I did a little bit of blood drift. We gotta clean drip. that up. Drip. 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 Blood. Drip. Can't have it. Unhealthy. Drip. Blood. Drip. Drip. Right here. Drip. There's a drip. Drip. There's a drip of blood. Drip. A couple drips of blood. <laughs> Clean it up with the Clorox wipe. We're not sponsored by Clorox, by the way. We're not sponsored by anyone. Yeah, none of our views. This is not sponsored either. We pay full price for the every plate. Who would want to sponsor us when we're too honest? Yeah, we're too honest with the reviews. And we're like, no, because you have to be sponsored. You have to like do like almost like a commercial. You can't say. Oh, look at this produce, it's messed up. Or look at this, that doesn't smell well, of right. of course not. Why, who would want to buy it? If yeah, I'll let me bad for business. So we're better off not being sponsored. I would hate to have to fake that, like leave out anything that's bad and pretend like everything's good. I guess that's all right now until the sauce and stuff goes in this after it cooks a little bit. Okay, I'll be back after the pork is ready for the sauce. It's tomato sauce for it. Okay, so now we're going to need these two packs of tomato paste in there along with a cup of water. And then after it's done, Lime juice, and guess what in the meat? Butter. Butter in the meat. That's a new one, but that's what it says, so. I got <laughs> buttery meat. All that extra <laughs> sweet tea. <laughs> sweet tea. Cup of water. Yep, one cup of water. So make the paste watery. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. <laughs> Voila. Mm -hmm. Okay. Make sure the paste gets all over the meaties. Chunkies, or we make the talking. So give us short. Oh, ah! sorry, Krissa. I burned Krissa. She's out of the. Ow! And then she hurt herself. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. Oh, oh day has been quite the day. Nice. Nice. Ow. 
Because remember, now, I also tricked today. Now she's traumatized. What garlic does this have? Oh, the sauce. Wait, does it? No. That was the other one. Oh, that, was, uh, oh, that one had the garlic in it. Because I thought we were doing that one because that was the recipe of the card that was Yeah, I actually took the wrong one. This one doesn't have garlic in it. This I is just tomato know. paste, right? Look yeah, I think it's just tomato. Tomato, tomato paste. Okay. Made from 100% Italian tomatoes. Mm -hmm. So Chris is now burned and going to the burn unit. No, just kidding, guys. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh, no! Okay. Finish cutting it up, and then I gotta turn it off. And then we gotta put butter and a couple squeezes of lime juice. I have two sodas. Just cut it up, make it have big chunks, and make sure it's all done, even though. Before the sauce was put in, I didn't, I didn't see any more pinks. But, yeah. This is what it looks like. It's almost done, yeah. Okay, so I need four tablespoons of butter. Oh. Adrian can do that, right? Four tablespoons of butter, and then I'll put some lime juice in there. Butter task is given in the meat, and then that will be done. Butter meat. Buttery meat. Buttery meat. Okay. Oh, I wonder if I'm going to be able to get that one. I know, it needs four. Ew, I'm going to get the edge. It just comes on the edge. Okay, if that's gum cut, it's just going to open a new one. Ew! Crumbs! Yeah. Some men like to put their crumbs. Buttery meat, 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 buttery I have two sodas. One with caffeine and one with that. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, I hope there's more butter. I bought some. I need butter. The butter is like gone up four times in price and now. And I ate it. I ate all the butter. It was yummy. Oh, no, Krista. Oh. There might be some, I think it's in the drawer. No, I found it. it. Buttery uh, good. All back here. I ate okay. all the butter. Yes, bad Carissa. Bad, bad Carissa. <laughs> I'm holding this spoon of butter. It's not. Oh, there we go. Okay, the butter goes in. While she's finishing up that, I'm going to get the tortillas out of the oven. Hopefully, they're not overbaked or too cold. Fun game. Find out which butter container actually contains butter. Butter, yeah. Okay, they're not cold, but they're not like really warm. But it's better than being overcooked, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, so I gotta mush this all in, and then I can start assembling. The tacos. It says turn off the heat when doing this, so it's, gonna, it's not going to melt quite as fast. Oh, oh wait, my sure it's kind of spread everywhere, so the meat's nice and buttery. That. Put the butter back. Oop, 
So I didn't let you lick the butter spoon, Princess. Sorry. Oh no! <laughs> My butter spoon! <laughs> okay. So, this is the coleslaw that goes on. There's extra hot sauce for anybody who wants extra hot sauce on theirs. This is the coleslaw. Tortillas, the onion. Let me see. Yeah. Some little scoopers for the onions. And then there's a lime to put on the plate. Let me get some plates out. Hi guys, did you know I'm still here? Oh, yeah. my other hip! Hi, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, now you injured yourself again. Okay, so let me lower this camera a little bit. It's been up so high. Whoops. I didn't realize how high it was up there. I should have had it lower. Sorry, guys. <gasps> yes, sorry. Oh, gosh, Chris. We got to redo the whole video. We got to redo the whole video. Put everything back. Uncook it. Uncook, uncook everything. Uncook. Uncook. <laughs> oh, man, it's so cold. I know. I tried not to do it, but... I tried, your best. I tried my best oh, no. it's warmer, but oh well. I didn't want to dry out this time, so. Okay, put the pork on. Put the porygon. Porygon. Okay, so there's the pork on the tortillas. And we're gonna put some of the slaw on. Oh, it shrunk once it got the stuff all over it. It's mixed yeah. up. Remember, the other day when I was making the slaw, and I thought the bowl was gonna be too small. It wasn't the mayonnaise. Yeah. Soft, you know, so soft. The, slaw. the mayonnaise will eat it the cold slaw and the crispy onion. The crispy onion we've had in tacos before, and it's, I thought it was weird, but it's actually pretty good. It goes oh, This one still has the peel. Like my hopes this one still has the peel on it. It's oh, the no. peel, actually. It's a fried peel. <laughs> Yay! Fried onion peel! It's my favorite thing to eat! Yay! Yay! I hope there's more! Go <laughs> eat it, Krissa! Wow, that's interesting! <laughs> <laughs> okay. And there we go! The pork tacos! So, oop, it flipped open. So, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up! If you have not already, please subscribe for more of our cooking shows and we'll see you later. Goodbye! Bye. <laughs>